विच मेडिकेशन इज यूज एज ए फर्स्ट लाइन ट्रीटमेंट फॉर स्टैटस एपिलेप्टिकस ए कार्बामजेपाइन बी वैलप्रोविक एसिड सी डाइजिपाम डी फेनिटॉइन एंड द करेक्ट आंसर इज सी डाइजिपाम Dizepam is the first line treatment for status epilepticus because it acts quickly to calm excessive electrical activity in the brain effectively stopping seizures it is a type of benzodiazepine which enhances the action of neurotransmitter called gaba leading to a sedative and anti seizure effect dizepam can be administered intravenously or rectally making it suitable for emergency situations where seizures need to be controlled immediately which disorder involves recurrent episodes of excessive daytime sleepiness and sudden muscle weakness a epilepsy B narcolepsy C restless legs syndrome D parkinson's disease and the correct answer is B narcolepsy Narcolepsy is a condition where the brain struggles to control when you sleep and stay awake this causes people to feel extremely sleepy during the day even after a full night's sleep Sometimes strong emotions like laughter or surprise can cause sudden muscle weakness making it hard to move or stay standing the main issue is a lack of a chemical in the brain that helps keep you awake and alert and the name of that chemical which is lacking in the brain of narcolepsy patients is orexin which is also known as hypocretin Which condition is marked by inflammation of the membranes covering the brain and spinal cord often due to infection A encephalitis B meningitis C hydrocephalus D cerebral palsy and the correct answer is B meningitis Meningitis is an inflammation of the protective membranes called meninges that cover the brain and spinal cord this inflammation is typically caused by an infection which can be viral bacterial or fungal symptoms of meningitis can include headache fever stiff neck sensitivity to light and confusion Which type of surgery is performed to remove a tumor from the brain? A craniotomy, B laminectomy, C discectomy, D spinal fusion. And the correct answer is A craniotomy. A craniotomy is performed to remove a brain tumor because it allows surgeons direct access to the tumor. During the procedure a portion of the skull is temporarily removed to expose the brain this opening gives the surgical team the ability to carefully remove the tumor while minimizing damage to the surrounding healthy brain tissue a craniotomy is often necessary for tumors that are located deep within the brain after the tumor is removed the piece of skull is typically replaced and secured Which condition is caused by a viral infection leading to inflammation of the brain? A meningitis, B encephalitis, C hydrocephalus, D cerebral palsy. And the correct answer is B encephalitis. Encephalitis is a condition caused by a viral infection that leads to inflammation of the brain.
it often results from common viruses like herpes simplex virus enteroviruses or mosquito borne viruses symptoms may include fever headache confusion and in severe cases seizures or loss of consciousness which surgical intervention involves cutting the corpus callosum to reduce the spread of epileptic seizures a temporal lobectomy b thalamotomy c pallidotomy d corpus callosotomy and the correct answer is d corpus callosotomy A corpus callosotomy is a surgical procedure that involves cutting the corpus callosum, the bundle of nerve fibers connecting the two hemispheres of the brain. This procedure helps to prevent the spread of epileptic seizures from one side of the brain to the other. It is typically used in severe cases of epilepsy when other treatments have not been successful. which condition results from the damage to the peripheral nerves and often causes weakness numbness and pain in the hands and feet a multiple sclerosis b peripheral neuropathy c myasthenia gravis d parkinson's disease and the correct answer is b peripheral neuropathy Peripheral neuropathy occurs when there is damage to the peripheral nerves which transmit signals to the brain spinal cord and the rest of the body this damage can be caused by various factors including diabetes infections traumatic injuries or exposure to toxins the result is weakness numbness and pain in the hands and feet because the damaged nerves can't send proper signals to and from the brain which neurological condition is characterized by chronic pain and tenderness in the muscles ligaments and tendons a fibromyalgia b myasthenia gravis c multiple sclerosis d amyotrophic lateral sclerosis als and the correct answer is a fibromyalgia fibromyalgia causes chronic pain because the brain and nervous system become overly sensitive to pain signals This means that normal sensations like touch are felt as pain. The exact reason for this is unclear, but it involves how the nervous system processes pain differently in people with fibromyalgia. Which condition is referred to as Lou Gehrig's disease? A. Parkinson's disease. B. Alzheimer's disease. C. Amyotrophic lateral sclerosis (ALS). D. Multiple sclerosis. And the correct answer is Drop your answers in the comment section below. For downloading PDF content and for latest updates follow our Telegram channel. I have given the link in the description below. If you like this video don't forget to hit that like button. Thanks for watching.